much, Melissa. God bless bloggers. There was a time, a few decades ago, where the mainstream media was the only game in town. There was a time when Walter Cronkite decided what was news. Let me tell you, the men and women in this room, you represent power, and you represent democracy. For a long, long time, entrenched politicians in Washington have grasped on the power, have held on to control, and the people have been shut out of the game. And let me tell you something, each of you, you scared the hell out of Washington. Anyone remember a few years ago a fellow named Dan Rather? It used to be if someone went on television on the news and made something up, no one found out about it. And yet, the power of each of you to get a message out directly to the people, I'll tell you, Two and a half years ago, when we launched our campaign for U.S. Senate, January 17th, 2011, we launched the campaign on a conference call with bloggers. We didn't put out a press release. We didn't even let the mainstream know until the conference call was over because what we understood is in this campaign, Y'all were going to write a heck of a lot more. You were going to drive a lot more ideas. You were going to impact the conversation a whole lot more than a few newspapers and TV stations that wouldn't even notice the campaign until all the serious fights had been done. So I want to thank you for your courage, for your fearsome, tireless advocacy for liberty. Y'all are on the front lines taking this country back. Now, I may not know a whole lot, but I know one thing, which is I'm not going to stand between y'all and a party. But, Drogan, I do want to briefly do something, which is I want to collectively remember our friend and a toast to Andrew Breitbart. A great and fearless leader, and we all carry on with his unshakable, fearless spirit to speak the truth to power, and the more they quiver, the better job we're doing. God bless you. With that, keeping that, the day that Andrew died, thank you. The day that Andrew died, I emailed Larry, and I thought about what would happen if my best friend died, and uh, I tailored my email and such, and so I wanted to give two minutes. Speaking is a big, big thing at Blockbash. We charge a lot of money.